Hey guys, this is Mr. A Crazy here, and today is the one year anniversary of Toy Story 4. Yep, that's right. On this day in 2019, Toy Story 4 came out in theaters. Happy one year anniversary. It's been exactly it's been exactly one year since since this this Disney Pixar movie Toy Story 4 came out. Yeah. It was released in theaters on June twenty first, two thousand nineteen, the same day when the when the when the when the, when the, the new Child's Play movie came out, the same day as this movie. But I honestly prefer Toy Story four over Child's Play, the new Child's Play. Yeah, here's what the Blu-ray looks like. Yeah. Rated G, and it's a hundred minutes. Yeah, I said it right. It's 100 minutes. Rated G for general audiences, all ages. And yeah, I definitely remember seeing this movie in theaters when it first came out last year. And for what it is, I actually really enjoyed it. Yeah, because I mean, when, when Toy Story 4 was first officially announced, like it, it, it kind of scared it, it kind of scared moviegoers and audiences that that like I'm wondering was there really need for a Toy Story 4 and they kind of don't really think so they that they were thinking they were there wasn't really need for a Toy Story 4 since the third movie Toy Story 3 ended perfectly but but surprisingly for what it is I think Toy Story 4 it was still great it's still one of my favorite movies of 2019 along with Avengers Endgame and Joker and Once Upon a Time in Hollywood can't forget about that even the voice actors do a good job. Like, like you know, they're still really great. Like Tom Hanks and Tim Allen, and of course Annie Potts as Bo Peep, and of course that also includes new cast members like Keanu Reeves. Yeah, Keanu Reeves is in this movie as Duke Kaboom, and there's also Tony Hale as Forky, and there's also Keegan Michael Key and Jordan Peele as Bunny and Ducky. And yeah, yeah. E even the animation in this movie is really is really well made. It's really well well designed and colorful. And the animation is pretty colorful to look at, so that's great. That's nice. Oh yeah, even even the Blu-ray says right here it was from Disney Movie Rewards, and I think I and I think Toy Story Four. I think this is like one one of the one of the one of the last like Disney home video, home media releases to, to, to with 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 Disney Movie Rewards because they changed the name and they, and they kind of changed like like the, they kind of changed its way. Of course, like it's called Disney Movie Insiders, which is the new name for Disney Movie Rewards. And I think Toy Story 4, I think, is one of, one of the last home media releases from Disney to, to be with Disney Movie Rewards before moving on to Disney Movie Insiders. Yeah. But yeah, and when I went and saw this movie in theaters, like, I, I went and saw it with, with, my, with my parents, both, both my mom and dad, and we all really enjoyed it. And I do remember afterwards, we, we, went, we went to, like, a restaurant to, to eat dinner afterwards, which is a whole lot of fun. Yeah. Oh yeah, because even even one of the previews for, for for this movie, like in theaters, when I saw this movie in theaters, I I, do, I think I do remember they, they they did show a preview for the Adams Family 2019, directed by Conrad Vernon and Greg Tiernan, and of course there's the, there was also a preview for Arctic Dogs, and you you kind you kind of got you you guys know know how bad Arctic Dogs is, but but I think there might be some people out there who still like it, yeah, yeah, but but other than that, happy one year anniversary to Toy Story Four. And so that's going to be it for this video. So make sure to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you haven't yet. And as always, thanks for watching. And this is Mr. A. Crizzy saying goodbye, everybody. And that's about it.